What if I told you that you could actually grow taller after puberty? Now, yes, that might sound very strange and not only that actually unbelievable for that matter, but yes, it actually is possible. And the reason that it is possible is because we have an example, quite literally a living example, that this is possible. And not only is it possible, it's actually self-induced, meaning you can do it yourself. Now, I'm not going to be going into the details on the science behind more specifically how this works or just something really cool about it, but if you're really interested in that, you can go check out this video. So what exactly am I talking about and how can exactly you do this to in order to increase your height? Now, the person who did this actually increased his height from five foot three to six foot one, basically. And in terms of converting that to centimeters, that is 160 centimeters to 185 centimeters. Now, that is a ridiculously large increase. And how exactly did he go from five foot three to six foot one in his 20s? Yeah, I, uh, I didn't leave that part in. But yes, in his 20s, that might sound very, very strange. What the hell did he do? Well, if you don't know who I'm talking about, his name is Rustam Akhmetov. And yes, you're probably not even aware of this, but this was a long time ago, actually, he did this and showing that this is possible. He would probably wasn't even aware of it at that time, but this Russian high jumping expert actually ended up not being an expert originally. And he wanted to become an expert though, and he wanted to continue with high jumping. However, his coach told him that there is no possible way that you are going to be able to continue in high jumping and basically in your high jumping career if you don't grow taller. And he, Rustam really took that to heart. And what did he do? Well, he did tons and tons of things in order to improve his height. And indirectly, he was applying Wolf's Law, but he did improve his height. So what did he do? The first thing that he did was he held on a pull-up bar and he basically let gravity do the job of Wolf's Law. And that is actually a very, very important part of Wolf's Law actually is letting gravity do its job. The second thing that he did was he would work out often. Now, this isn't actually something that I would recommend that you do. And I'm not going to be explaining the details behind this a ton, but to keep it really, really short, when it comes to working out, you I don't think that you want to be stimulating this inflammatory response over and over and over and over and over again. I don't think that is healthy at all. Anyways, I'm going to be having a video out on that eventually. So if you're interested, uh, subscribe to the channel so you can see when that video comes out. And the third thing that he did was something called banded sleeping, which looks a little something like that. So <laughs> yeah, uh, it's a little bit on the extreme side or might look on the extreme side, but this does work because this does stimulate Wolf's Law. And once again, um, you can quite literally change your bone structure, not just of your height, but of anything. And I literally do mean anything. Me meaning, yes, you can make your face more attractive. And if you're interested in that, go check out this video or just go check out my bone remodeling playlist because it'll be explaining that. Now, what's crazy is that all of this was actually done over the course of three years. Now, that might sound absolutely ridiculous. And yes, uh, it is ridiculous and it works. <laughs> and that's because once again, it's working with Wolf's Law and it's understanding how Wolf's Law works. Hopefully this goes to show you that actually you can grow past adolescence and the whole puberty phase. Because once again, he did it and I guarantee you can do it too. All you have to do is understand Wolf's Law. If you found the video helpful or informative, uh, actually, if you want to speed up this entire process, go click my Cerule link and get Cerule from me. Because yes, uh, one, I think Cerule will definitely help with this. More specifically, I think Stem Enhance and Plasma Flow will help with this. I'm not going to be explaining the details of that because I've already made a Cerule playlist. So if you're interested in the details on how some of this stuff works, then you can go check that out. Thanks again for watching. If you found the video helpful or informative, please like, share, subscribe, comment down below because it really does help the channel grow. And if you're interested in seeing all of my videos ahead of time, please click the join button down below where you can see all of my videos ahead of time as well as support me personally. So once again, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.